As I suspected, we can't revive the Vile God with the Furies and Faith Drop alone. The blood of the Vile God's daughter is a vital component to breaking the seal. I did inform you of this, didn't I? Perhaps you'd like to volunteer some of your blood, Bernard. After all, you are a descendant of the Vile God as well. Unfortunately, tradition dictates that a woman must be sacrificed. I see. Well, all in due time. The daughter of the Vile God will come to us, guided by the ominous blood flowing in her veins. We're here, the stairway to heaven. Let's hope this is the last time we have to fight Dorfa. What's up, Ming? Guys, are you really sure about this? What do you mean? I mean, I've been dragging you around all over the place, so... Are you sure about this? You could die, you know? Why are you saying that now? She's right! We've got no regrets, buddy! No matter what happens, Fang, I'll follow you to the ends of the Earth! I pretty much feel the same way, Fang. <laughs> oh, Fang! You're crying! No, I'm not! My eyes just got a little... snot in them, that's all. How could you possibly get snot in your eyes? Come on, you idiots! Let's go! Hit! <laughs> 
Fang. Fancy seeing you alive. Resilient as a cockroach. Mariana, I don't have time to mess around with you! Out of my way! I'm afraid I can't back down. You see, it's my mission to defeat all of you. Kill him all! Kill him all! Kill him all! I will not allow you to stand in Dorfa's way. Mess you up. Let's go, Eren. <laughs> not yet. What are you doing? My turn. <laughs> New data. <laughs> My turn. My turn. Ready. <laughs> Here we go. What the fuck? Not yet. What are you doing? Let's go, Aaron. I'll see you. I'm ready. Here we go. Welcome, daughter of the wild god. You surprise me. I never expected you to come here of your own volition. It seems you cannot define your blood's true fate. You're wrong! I'm here to sever that fate! I won't let you carry out your scheme! So foolish. You will never break the curse flowing through your veins. You're a slave to your bloodline, and nothing more. Tiara, I've got your back. I thought we will help. Thing! Tiara is... What? I'll be claiming our prize now. Tiara! Wait! There is no escape. I will kill you myself. Out of my way! Let's do this! Not yet! What? Here we go! Eat this! My turn! Impossible! What the fuck? Let's do this! Impossible! sort of thing these days you will regret your idiotic show of mercy I will kill you someday when you least expect it do whatever you want just remember that the next time you fight me I'm still gonna win Fang, hurry Tiara's in danger yeah I know
nothing. That's nothing. Let's do this. New data. Ha! Huh, my turn. A, A, yeah. Let's go, A. It's not over yet. Yeah. Muscle mode. Here we go. Yeah, one, two, punch. Soul smoke. Pain don't hurt. That's nothing. Getting uh, fired up. Okay. Next. You did it, Aaron. Daughter of the Vile God, welcome to the Temple of Darkness. Sherman, what are you going to do to me? Once the ritual to revive the Vile God is complete, I shall kill you and become his new host. By sealing the Vile God within me, I will bring peace to this world. Impossible. Are you attempting to become a god? That is the only path left to me. I had to kill you once before, to prevent the revival of the Vile God. <laughs> All I had left after that was a combination of love, hate, 
and guilt I felt toward you. In order to escape those feelings, I devoted myself fully to cutting down those I deemed as evil. But then I realized something. The goddess's power was inferior to the vile gods. This is proved by the fact that the forces of evil in this world are much greater than the forces of good. And if the goddess's power cannot defeat the vile god, I have no choice but to accept his power into my body and take control of it. And this time, I will kill you in order to revive the vile god. Let us bring about world peace together. Let's move! Beyond this point lies holy ground. I will not let it be defiled by the likes of you! Turn back, at once! Same to you! Mess you up! Let's do this! Slash! Uh -huh. I'll uh -huh. see you! Die! It's not over yet! Here we go! Eat this! Uh -huh. Hot! I'll do my best. Yes. 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 Get ready. Yes. 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 Here we go. Yes. 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 Die. Oh, this hurt. is interesting. Yes. 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 No escape, eh? New data. Fire. My turn. Get ready. Here we go! You actually backed me into a corner. However, this ends now. Are you ready to feel despair? Don't cut me out. Here we go! My ambitions. Now to analyze all this data. Looks like I got stronger. My power has increased. I will not accept this. Defeated by such inferior beings. I will never accept this. <laughs> and stay down.
Let's do this. New data. Fire. Mode. My turn. Let's go in. Die. That's a win for us. Surprise. I never expected you to survive your wounds. It seems I've underestimated you once again. Yeah? Well, I'm just full of surprises, so how about you shove your compliments and release Tiara? You fool. The Vile God will revive soon. I'll celebrate his rebirth by spilling your blood. It'll be a historic bloodbath. Sherman! Settle this once and for all! Show me what you got! Get ready! Uh, Here I come! Uh, uh, here we go! Fire! Uh, uh, My turn! Right. Stop moving! Get ready! Uh, uh, Here we go! Uh, uh, I expected as much from you. I suppose I can get a little serious. Here I come. We'll stop you! Uh, uh, idiot! I'm so sorry. You're finished, Sherman! Your efforts are futile. Struggle all you like. You're still too late. Look! The vile god is reviving. Oh god! Fang! Kill me! Please! Yara! There's still time! You can prevent the vile god's revival by killing me right now! Don't be stupid! There's no way in hell I'm gonna do that! You can't kill her, Fang? I certainly can. Fang, wait! Try to remember what happened before we were sent to the past. When Tiara was killed. You should be able to see it now. <sighs> Is everything alright, Lord Sherman? We're at a crucial juncture right now. If we lose this battle, we're finished. Tiara. I already know you're a descendant of the Vile God. That's why... I'm going to kill you. <gasps> our dream is to protect the peace of this world. You'll die for our dream, won't you, Tiara? Very well. As you wish. Ah! Pitiful human. Do you hate me? You're... If I did not exist, you never would have killed that girl. Hate me, and hate all those who have fallen into evil. Fill yourself with hatred, and dye your soul red. I don't need you to tell me what to do. That was my plan all along! What the hell? Sherman killed Tiara? But things are different now. Last time, Sherman killed Tiara to keep the Vile God from reviving. He did it for world peace. But now, Sherman is going to kill Tiara so the Vile God can enter his body in order to claim the world as his own. What's coming? The Vile God is coming! Fang, hurry! You have to kill me! <laughs> if you kill Tiara, the world will be saved. To save one life, or the lives of many. What are you gonna do, Fang? There's no time to hesitate, Fang! Hurry! Shut up! Stop freaking out! I'm calling!
calling the shots here! Didn't I tell you I was gonna change fate? How am I supposed to do that if I kill you? Fang! Stupid fool. Do you really think you can defy fate? All you've done is sacrifice the world! <sighs> and with this, my wish has been granted. Fang. In the end, you couldn't even protect Tiara. Watch as she sacrificed to awaken the vile god. <sighs> Finally, the Vile God has come! <laughs> the power of the Vile God is mine! I've inherited his ancient bloodline. I'm the only one truly worthy to receive his power! Oh, Vile God, newly awakened from your eternal slumber, grant me your power! <laughs> <coughs> But... I'm a descendant of the Vile God. Why? It seems the Vile God doesn't care if his thirst is sated by a man's blood or a woman's. He was a fool for offering up his blood in place of Tiara's. But thanks to him, the Vile God is finally awakened. O oh, vile god, with this sword I surrender my body, my soul, and my wish onto you, so that you may receive it.
are down. It all ends. We all die. Let's go, Aaron. New data. My turn. And Sash mode. My turn. What you punch? You Sash mode. Fang looks hurt. What the? Aaron, you... Fang, I will give you the power of the goddess. It all ends! Behold my power! Let's go, Aaron! Slash! 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 New data! Fire! Ha! I'm ready! Yeah! My turn! Yes! Yeah! Win! Get ready! The vile god really is stronger than the goddesses. Don't worry, I'm not gonna lose to someone like him. Fang, don't tell me you're. Are you trying to save Sherman like you saved me? <sighs> you are, aren't you? <sighs> what? What is this place? Fang, what are you thinking? There's no way you can defeat the Vile God with that blade. Sherman, are you planning to rescue me? Don't bother. That wish of yours can no longer be granted. After all, my soul no longer resides here. It was consumed by the Vile God. <sighs> I have no regrets about this outcome. I willingly chose to become one with the Vile God. In doing so, I thought I would be able to control the Vile God's power. But as you can see, things turned out rather differently. So Fang, I'm going to entrust you with my dream. Please, protect this world. What? You're asking me that now? Quit screwing with me! Stop being selfish! Why should I listen to you anyway? If you want to protect this world so badly, do it yourself! I've entrusted you with my dream, Fang. The rest is up to you. without my permission. I never liked you from the moment we first met. Sherman. Shut up. Stop your jabbering. I'm not gonna hold back anymore. I'm not gonna show you any mercy. You better brace yourself. 
vile god! Let's go! It all let me hold my power! Get ready! New data! Fire! Ha! My turn! Disappear! Ha! I'll do my best! Catch! Catch! Swing! Let's go, eh? Ha! Yes! My turn! What a relief. I'm so glad Dorfa rehired me. A lot has happened. But no matter what happens to Dorfa, there's still no other company I'd rather work for. Well, yeah. There's no other corporation as large as Dorfa. But it looks like the new president is really strict. Oh, I already know that. That's why I brought a present to pay my respects. Pardon me. I, Paiga, I've come to pay you my respects. Please enjoy this gift. It's a famous sweet bean paste. 
They only sell 10 of these a day. I stood in line for hours to get it. All for your sake, President Mariana. If you have time to shop for gifts, then you have time to work. Work, work, work! If you don't increase your productivity, I'll fire you so fast your head will spin. <laughs> Please, not that. Anything but that. Hey, handsome. You're a fencer, right? I've got some great information. You interested? Ah, so you're an informant. Yeah, I'm down. What do you got? Before we get to that, I'll need 30,000 gold. That's expensive. There's no way I can afford that. Can't you lower the price a little? Don't you know that strong fencers pay top price for information? And you definitely look strong to me. I is that so? 30,000 gold, huh? That's pretty cheap, actually. Thank you for your patronage. Hmm, the sun is shining and the weather is pleasant. It's a perfect day to go on another journey. Yes, I agree. Goldikins! Did you double check to make sure you have everything? You've got your hanky and your blanky, right? It's all good. I made sure to stick them both in my pack. There are other important things, you know. It's not like we're going out for a stroll. We're traveling the world. Are you guys going to be all right? No worries. As long as I bring the energy and enthusiasm, things are going to be all right. That's right. It's okay to be a little scatterbrained and screw up every now and then. Perfectionism is overrated, eh? I just want to run into fun things. That's pretty much the whole reason I'm going on this journey. I want to learn more about the world so I'm even more fun to be around. <laughs> That's all! So what was that battle anyway? The goddess used up all her power to seal the vile god away. And once again, both the goddess and the vile god have fallen into a deep sleep. The furies we've collected have scattered throughout the world, and everything has gone back to normal. Yeah, but we saw it with our own eyes. Those who carved out their fate, who used their own hands to change their destiny. This world is shaped by our desires and our power. So we should do our best to ensure we're making the world a better place. What do you guys think? Hmm... That sounds about right. I can agree with that. Me too. Well, let's get going, eh? Stay healthy, everyone! Pippin, Ethel, what are you two going to do? Well, I've been observing this young lass, Ethel. She's lacking in common sense, and is far too ignorant of the world. It seems like a good idea to take her under my wing. After all, perhaps it was fate that we met under these circumstances. No way. Please, don't say that. So much has happened to us lately. We might get lonely if it's just the two of us again. I won't get lonely, but maybe I wouldn't mind if someone else came with us. Well then, it's decided! You plan to return to your home, right, Holly? I understand you have articles, right? Yeah, I've been thinking about documenting everything that's happened. Documenting? Yeah, how's this for an opening? When light and darkness still bore life, the goddess emerged and... Hmm, still needs work. That sounds like a daunting task. I guess I'm going to be pretty busy cleaning up after you. I think it's a job worth doing, don't you agree, Bahas? Yeah, for both of us. What a lovely breeze! This is where we first met, Fing. Remember? You and Aaron. Yeah, you're right. Did Aaron really disappear? Well, she was originally part of the goddess. She just went back to where she belonged. Did you make sure to say goodbye when you were inside the goddess's light? <sighs> my memories, my feelings, they're all disappearing, Fang. I guess I'm going back to the goddess now. I don't want this. I don't want to forget about you, Fang. I'll never forget you. Don't worry. You'll always be a part of me. Thank you. Goodbye, Fang. You better be nice to Tiara.
<laughs> that smile on your face. You look like you're remembering something perverted. I wasn't smiling about anything. Yes, you were. A really big grin. Right, Kiwi? Kiwi, Kiwi! <clears throat> now might not be a good time to say this, but... I was always jealous of Aaron. I always felt a bond between you and Aaron. As your fairy partner. A connection I could never be part of. I want to watch you from the spot closest to you. I want to know more about you than anyone else. Do you hate me for saying that? Come on, don't just pour your heart out like that all of a sudden. You said everything I wanted to say. Huh? I'm not a fencer anymore, but I still want to protect you. So... Think. Long ago, when light and darkness still bore light, 